I'm Tom Bowers, and I'll be delivering the Gladys Coates University History Lecture on October 15th. I'll focus on the early years of journalism at Carolina, from about 1890 to the founding of the Department of Journalism in 1924. I'm standing near Carroll Hall, current home of the School of Journalism and Mass Communication. Over there, you can see the Phillips Annex. In 1900, the university moved its printing plant to a one-story brick building that stood where Phillips Annex now stands. The university's power plant stood where Carroll Hall now stands. The printing plant published scientific journals and university publications, as well as the Tar Heel. It employed students who were interested in newspaper journalism. Among them was Oscar Coffin, who earned 15 cents an hour as a typesetter. His attitude was expressed in the 1909 Yakety Yak. Here's to those who love us well, all the rest can go to hell. He followed that philosophy when he returned to campus to head the journalism program from 1926 to 1953. This suggests an image of Oscar Coffin gazing out the window of the printing plant at the future site of a school of journalism that he could not begin to comprehend. That's just one of the many fascinating stories of journalism at Carolina.